Hello, Procrast Creators. Today we are making picture shelving. So um, before I even tell you what's happening here, um, just wanted you to know you need to measure the size, size of the shelf that you want. I use one by four and one by one strips of wood. Um, as you can see here, I am using wood glue to um, glue the pieces together. So the, the piece that I just put the wood glue on is my bottom piece. So that piece will go to what will become the back. So I put two one by fours together, um, aligning them. Um, you'll see my husband come in. He's going to screw them. He's actually off camera now, which is why it's a little shaky um, screwing some other ones because we did several of these shelves at one time. Um, so once he uh, screws in probably four to five screws in the back, once that wood glue um, does its thing, he's going to come back. Actually, it doesn't all the way dry. We just... He starts to screw in there, and as you can see, he's screwing now. He does drop it, <laughs> which is funny to me, um, but he picks it back up and carries on because that's what we do, right? We drop stuff and we pick it up and carry on. So he um, finishes putting the rest of the screws down the back of this and then like i said you see the little strip still on the table that one by one strip is going to go um, be glued on and then go to the front of this which completes the shelf so it's a very easy project so that piece again goes on um, and from there i painted these shelves so you'll see them all on the floor here in the minute where I'm getting ready to paint them. And I just wanted to show you the different sizes that we did because we use this for several different projects. So um, again, you can make it the length that you want. And here's how I use them. Um, one was my son's trophy shelf. One was a picture shelf for my living room. One was a shelf for my son's bathroom. And then one became a shelf in my craft room. So again, you can use them a variety of ways. I hope this was helpful. Please comment, like, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.